Monaco is your sixth consecutive podium. How did it feel to finally win the Monaco Grand Prix? Yeah, the Monaco Grand Prix felt great to win. Um, it was something, um, of course, I didn't achieve before. Never been on the podium there before, so I didn't even know where to go initially. But uh, yeah, it was very nice to stand up there. And um, yeah, now, of course, we have to focus on, on the rest of the season. Red Bull Racing are currently leading the Constructors and Drivers Championships. It's our best start to the season since 2011. How does it feel to be in a car that's able to fight for wins and be this competitive so early on? Well, I think it's always the aim, you know, to be in a car like this as a team. And, of course, you know, to be leading both championships is great for us, a great boost, but we have to also keep it up now. So you've led for 222 laps this season compared to Lewis at 75. Do you think it will feel different being chased rather than being the chaser in the championship? For me personally, I don't think it's a difference in terms of how many laps you lead or being chased or the chaser. As long as you are leading, that's the most important for me. And... For me, there doesn't really change anything in terms of how I approach my weekend or drive. On the top of the championship standings, for the first time since Ayrton Senna won his third and final driver's championship in 91, Yamamoto-san has drawn similarities between yours and Senna's driving style. Do you agree that there are similarities? Of course, it's always very nice to hear those words um, from, of course, the people up at, at Honda, but I never compare myself with anyone. I'm just myself, and uh, I'm happy with that. I mean, from, from my side, it's always difficult to, to judge uh, someone else. I mean, I know Yuki, he's very young still, and, you know, the, the, the questions are, what are being raised at the moment. I mean, he does need more time. I think everyone needs more time when you are a rookie, and um, I'm sure Yuki will do very well in the future. I'm definitely very excited, you know, to race here in Baku again. I mean, it's a very interesting track, not easy at all. Um, and of course, we haven't been here last year. So, um, yeah, it's good you know, to get out there again. And hopefully it's going to be a really good and interesting weekend. Um, what do you expect from the weekend here? And why should fans tune in? At the moment, it's difficult to say what to expect because we haven't driven here yet. But of course, we target a podium at least, but we want to win. And, um, yeah, fans should always tune in. What else do you want to do on a Sunday? Final question. You're going racing in Zambor in just a few months' time. Are you looking forward to racing on home turf? Yeah, of course I'm looking forward to, to racing Zandvoort. Zambor. I mean, it's my home track. Um, but, yeah, let's see. I mean, hopefully, of course, a lot of fans will be there as well. So it can be just a, a, great, a great weekend in general.